man. Go ahead. That he may be able, by sound doctrine, mm -hmm. both to exalt uh -huh. and to convince the gangsayers. And that's what we doing, man. We're out here convincing the gangsayers. At one time when the shoot started off, it was a small cluster, man. It went from a small concentrated cluster to it's, it's bloomed, man. It's bloomed just like vines. You know how vines will take, it'll, it'll start a little bit, then it'll take over the whole tree. This is like a nun to that, man. It says what? A, it's a, a, a size of a mustard seed. This truth was like unto that mustard seed. Now it's grown into a, a, a it's flourishing, man. And we've seen proof of it, man. We've we seen random people that would notice this and notice men that are doing the work, man by way of the internet, which was set up for this truth, man. The internet was not set up for you to make uh, 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 vlogs, man, okay? We're, we're making a righteous vlog, okay? But this is the truth that's taken down this place, man. We're chaining Babylon down. Go ahead, I. Good. It says, we would have healed Babylon, but she is not healed. Mm -hmm. Forsake her and, and let us go, everyone, into his own country. Yep. For her judgment reaches unto heaven and is lifted up even to the sky. That man, look, the ticket is getting ready to be punched. All we're doing, we're telling you what is all the judgment that's gonna be passed, man. Don't be mad at the newscast when it tells you it's gonna rain, man. We're telling you it's over. America is done. It's getting ready to be judged by the Most High, what you ignorantly call God, man. He's getting ready to judge his place for the homosexuality, the transgenderism. It's a rap, man. That's right. He's the pedophilia. The, uh, the, the just confusion period, man. Yep. You got people that's, that's training their children up from the age of two and three to be cross dressers. Yep. Oh, Timmy, that's cute. You can wear my high heels. Yep. That's wicked, man. You think the Lord ain't gonna destroy this place for that, man? Training their little girls to, to grow up to be boys at the age of five. Teach them to play football, man. You can do it. Go ahead, Rebecca. Yep. You can do anything a man can do. That's wicked, man. A boy's supposed to be a boy, and a girl's supposed to be a girl, man. That's right. That's the way the Lord set it up, and that's why you damn people go burn, man. Right. And they always do it intentionally. Oh, you have a son? All right, we're going to change him into a girl. You got a girl? Okay, like, we're going to change her into a boy. Why is that? Bro. If they if they are so concerned about people's genders, why can't they just leave them what they are? Right. No, they got to intentionally uh, 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 turn them out to something different because they know that that's going to affect the youth, yeah. and they gonna, you know, be destroyed. Right. They destroy mental shit, and not only that, in the schools they doing it in the cartoons yep. now. Yep. I seen the car. Yep. My, I seen my niece watching the cartoon the other day. It was a superhero boy dressed up as a, a superhero yep. girl. They they they, they, they put the ones on Netflix too. Yeah, it's on Netflix. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, yeah. Man, you need to turn that shit off. Right. They're right. grooming, they're grooming, the, hey, they're grooming their minds, man. Right. When a, a so-called a pedophile, what does he do? He grooms before he actually does the act. That's what Esau's doing, man. And like the brother's saying, look, the Lord has destroyed kingdoms for less. Right. He says it would be more tolerable for Sodom and Gomorrah than this place, man. That's, right, huh? That's a shame, man, that Sodom and Gomorrah was considered more righteous than this place. But this is Sodom coming back. That's why it says in Revelations, it says what? Sodom and Egypt, man. Why does it say Sodom and Egypt? What's on the back of the United States dollar, man? What's on the back of the dollar, my man? A pyramid. Where does that pyramid come back from? Egypt. Why isn't it a turtle dove? Why isn't it a so-called cross, man? Okay, that's showing you this place is in the vibration of Egypt, man. They teach Sodom. You know? I asked you because they teach Sodom. <laughs> you know? Go they ahead, say it's lawful. Yeah, you under your commander, yeah, General Yohanna. Yeah, under your commander, General Yohanna. Yeah, yeah, you do. General Yohanna teach Sodom. Not being gay? Yeah. You can sleep with your life because the wedding bed is under the cloud. General Yohanna teach Sodom. The wedding bed is under the cloud. He said he could rehabilitate on the sex floor. No, no, you watch your damn mouth. Yeah, General Hunter teach sodomy. Y'all believe in sodomy, man. Yeah. Y'all yeah. 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 teach false doctrine, man. Y'all yeah. yeah. teach false doctrine, man. You know what? Let's edit this, man. Edify this, man. Y'all just niggas, man. They already been. They can't. They had we don't need their attention. They needed ours. They that's needed why, ours. That's why the Lord is going to destroy this place. Because of false prophets, false doctrines, false teachers, these false laws, all, all these false two-thirds people out here, man. That's why the Lord is going to destroy Babylon, America, man. You, anytime you teach sodomy is lawful, you a wicked nigga, man. That's right. And That's all to it, And man. he said that they gonna take the chip. Right. Johanna right. said if you wanna eat, you gonna take the chip. So how would you follow a man that's telling you to take the very mark that's gonna get you killed, man? That's right. So he don't care for the sheep. They're hirelings, man. Oh, yeah. 
This uh, Titus 1, Titus 1 and 10, for they are mainly unruly and vain talkers and deceivers, especially they of the circumcision. Yep, yep, that's them. Whose mouth must be stopped. And the Lord is going to stop their mouth. The Lord is going to knock all their teeth out, man. Teaching sodomy is legal. Teaching is okay to, to uh, what? Accept, accept the chip? Teaching they can rehabilitate a homosexual? Yep. Come on, man, be for real. Whose mouths must be stopped, who subvert whole houses. And that's what he do. That's subverting your whole house when you're teaching that it's okay to do your woman in the butt. Yep. That's sodomy, man. Hey, not only that, uh, I remember listening to him talk about it. He said, he said, there is a chance you can catch hepatitis. Right. You know, but <laughs> so, so that's supposed to be good for you to catch hepatitis and then give it to your female? It's like, come on. And see, like them, them, almost them niggas in that. Right. It's like they right walk, there. they walk, they walk on the other side of the street, and they had to, I guess, build a curve. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Never been in there, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. And then so, I guess the, somebody, I don't know, I the guess they, yeah, the hype man well. had to get there. We got and then, this. If y'all call y'all Israel, y'all came by uh, the house of the Lord. You, and you, didn't, you, didn't, you didn't even give a fucking greeting, man. They didn't even salute. You didn't even fucking salute. They the first people. They the first one. You know what I mean? Then you, know you probably trying to uh, uh, speak up, uh, uh, uphold the scriptures with a, with your head covered. That's right, right. Why? Because they honor they 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 uh, father saint. Look, they stood on top of Buffalo Man right here, yeah, right in front of them. Yeah, yeah, they yeah, yeah. they right stood on. right there on top of Buffalo right Man. On, man. It says, whose mouths must be stopped, who subvert whole houses, teaching things which they are not. Right. See? Wow. And what you hear, wow. taking a chill. And what do you hear from them always? They talk about black, Let me get this. black this, black that. They're pushing Esau's narrative. Right. Black identity extremists. Yep. His hat said, God is black. You know, we ain't, we ain't out here teaching the color. We're out here teaching the nationality, a bloodline, a heritage. They know they you know? Right. And they over here pushing that, that, uh, that black movement. Gun. And it says, for filthy lucre's sake, the brothers just say he sold out. And that's what they yep. be teaching. See, these, these, these niggas ain't getting nothing, but the head, they head got money. Yep. That's how they do it. You know, I guess they, they like a fucking pyramid scheme. I was just getting it. You took it right out of my You know what I mean? And it, only the top echelon gets the actual fact, man. But see, you see they get upset when you talk about their daddy, General Yohan. You mm -hmm. see what I'm saying? Their, their father. This, uh, they, they know different or know better than Birdman and, 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 uh, and uh, Lil Wayne. Man, they worse. They really you know what I'm do their actions. They're trying to set us up, man. Yeah. You out here with a, with a vest on. What is that push? Right. What is that push? What are you trying to be? It says what? The, the most high shows in the lonely of this world. They came up here with a a, a, a rah rah at it. You see what I'm saying? We're not we're not we ain't in the time for that, man. We're lonely servants and, and coming out here and, and doing this thing off faith, man. We don't need a what do you need a best for? That's putting an image out of what, man? Violence, Violence man. That's right. James 1 and 26. If any man among you seem to be religious and bridle not his tongue, but deceiving his own heart. This man's religious is vain, man. There's his vain, bro. There's his totally vain. Now, now, the scriptures say, what, make the body a living sacrifice, right? right. Now, what does a damn wonderful mess got to do with that? Now, <laughs> the spirit, the spirit, the spirit. They, they just mentioned in the same thing you talk about. It. Now, but I'm going to reread this real quick. But see, that shows ignorance, too, because you got a bulletproof vest on, but you have no helmet. Like, can't nobody blow your brain down. Right. Yeah. See what I'm saying? People take headshots nowadays, man. This is, uh, uh, this is uh, Isaiah 30 and 10. It say, would say to the seers, see not, but to the prophets, prophesy not. It says, kind of, uh, prophesy not unto us right things, but speak unto us smooth things. That's right, yeah. Prophesy the seat. That's, That's right, right. They, they, want That's right. they want to hear that smooth message. All you can do with the world doing, you can, you can practice. You can be a sodomite. They want they want to hit it. They, they want to preach that smooth thing. Right. They're not telling them that you have Hashem and Shai going to destroy you for this act. That is an act of wickedness unto the Lord, man. And it's an abomination, man. Right? All right? They, they want they want they want everybody to just they rocking with the show, man. Now, and it's now, oh, and we just saluted them like Shalom. I, you know, the, the chip is an embargo on Shalom. I, you can't commit sodomy. They, they, they're like, oh yeah, brother, hey Shalom, you know. They'd have been down for it, you know what I'm saying? They wanted, they wanted our attention. Right. Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah. But see, like the scripture say, I am I therefore become your enemy because I, I tell you the, the truth, truth, man. Kind. The truth hurts, man. That's right. They, they whoever came up with their lies, sticks and stones may break my bone, but words may never hurt. They ain't heard the right words before, yeah. man. They heard the right you know what I'm saying? Hebrews 4 and 12. Yeah. The word is sharper than any two-edged sword. There you go. They get cut by the word. I got it. Hebrews chapter 4, verse 12. And it says. For the word of Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai is quick and powerful and sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing even to the dividing asunder of soul and spirit. Hey, this and is our greatest weapon, man. Right. And that's what and, and the brother read it earlier to sound doctrine. They they don't have sound doctrine, man. They don't have sound. They and they and they, and they got a, 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 a what is it called a regiment of gear. That's when you see brothers diverse. Garments, you know, they, they're they're cookie cut type of the same thing with IUIC. Or IUIC. Yep. They all they gotta have the same garments on, and it was not like that, man. The, the, this thing is not about so called outer appearance, man. You know, they they're trying to look tough. They, they said the guys that act the toughest are the smallest inside, man. You know, the they, the quiet guys are the ones you watch for, man. You know. Hey, and not only that, but when you see them come up, they had that proud spirit on them. That's right. You know, the scriptures say uh, before uh, a fall coming pride. And, and what did uh, what did Yahweh Shai say? He said that the meek shall inherit the earth. You know, ain't nothing meek about that. You seen dude? He was all like this. Yeah, he's all like, come on, man. We he he tried to, he, he to do some. Uh, some uh, pump muscles and shit, like he just plugged himself into a, a bike pump, just coming up all swollen and shit. Yeah, man, can I read it? It's a rock 11 and 4. Boast not of thy clothing and raiment, and exalt not thyself in the day of honor. For the works of the Lord are wonderful, and his works among men are hidden. That's why, like they were saying, that's like they only strength is those clothing lines. If you take that clothing off them and put them on like a bed sheet or something, they feel powerless, man. Yeah. They, they ain't really got the faith. They're all about the outward appearance. Esau look at that. Uh, Esau looks at that. When you in that yeah, uniform, you look like that. They look at that as uh, uh yeah, like you a military. Then y'all wearing black anyway. Like You know. And that's how you know those are just really just niggas and garments. They still got they still got their old man attached. They never put that off. You know, that's why before they came up, I told the bro, I said, watch the intimidation tech. And that's exactly that's what, what that did. was. Yep. A failed attempt at that one. That, that's, you know? that's NWG. You know, not NWA, but NWG. Yeah. You said yeah. niggas with garbage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 And, and, they, and they, on, they on Instagram posting up with guns yeah. and, and liquor bottles. You know those fans bought liquor everywhere? But empty liquor bottles. Though. Yeah, they didn't even, even throw them away. <laughs> what do you say? Yeah, they just like, hey, right, hey man. Niggas ain't recycling. I don't know what the fuck. Back in the world, back in the world, right? Back in the world, the little dude that was doing all that talking, I would have just stepped up and bust him in the mouth and wouldn't really worry about nobody else. Because you the one around your mouth, you going to get hit first. Yep, that's right. And we going to worry about the rest. Because when I follow, when I hit you in your mouth, I'm going to kick you in your face. And then they might be the two toughest the rest of them. That's right. But y'all gonna see when Esau, that same tough ass little nigga on the left, I saw him, he swole up. When Esau pull that gun out of you, it's gonna be a whole different tune. She gonna, gonna take the chip. Yeah. She gonna take the chip. Out of this, y'all don't have no fear of the Lord. They might, ain't got, that's it. Y'all don't have no fear of the Lord. No fear, man. You, you are, you, you, you doing the same thing that, that the church is doing to our people, man. Continue to make our people go off. You're no better than the neighborhood past uh, uh, Pastor T.D. Jakes, man. They worse because you're preaching, you, you're preaching a, 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 a um, you're preaching a false doctrine unto our people, man. You continue to have our people go off, and you might, you're gonna be judged the same way as they are, man. I got it. It says Proverbs one and seven: The fear of the Lord Yahweh is the beginning of knowledge, but fools despise wisdom and instructions, and, and, and they despise it, man. They walk by, and they instead of just being like the brother said, saluting us. And, and pushing, they want to intimidate, man. The intimidating factor. When did this truth say be an intimidator, man? Like the brother quoted said, the meek, man, the lonely. This, the, mo the, the most I didn't pick them guys. If he wanted the toughest, it'd be a bunch of so-called football built guys sitting. You know what I'm saying? Hard, tough, uh, uh, so-called people, man. We're meant to be lonely. 
Those guys do not have the the, the, the love. It says you shall know the love they have them. I bet them dudes talk shit on each other, man. The same thing, man, they do, man. Oh, yeah, 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 brother. Your shirt ain't black enough today, brother. Yeah. You have to get that, that you know? New black shirt. You gonna have to get a new black shirt. Your boots scuffed up, huh? Hey, brother, we don't, we, you all right, all right? Job, Job 28, 28. And it took man, he said, Behold, the fear of Yahweh, that is wisdom. And to depart from evil is understanding, man. So it's real evil. It's, it's, it's evil when y'all say uh, uh, that you could you could act basically uh, participate in sodomy. Yep. Or you say uh, chip is an embargo. That's evil, man. That's evil. That's evil uh, speaking, man. That's not. That's not understanding, man. That's not you fearing the Lord. Yep. You know. Go ahead. This is Psalm 44 and 6 mm -hmm. for you tough guys. For I will not trust in my boat. Neither shall my sword save me. Mm -hmm. See what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. Go ahead, bro. That, and, that, and that's, he said you shouldn't trust in the boat or what? He said, uh, for I will not trust in my boat, neither shall my sword save me. And, that, and that's an instrument, a tool, right, of death, man. Right. Like Esau trusted in his, what, military. And that's what, that's not going to save him, man. Like they, like they trusted him. I'm pretty sure they probably walk around with pistols on them. Yeah. Probably do, because that's probably how do. scary they are, man. Yeah, some of them do. You know what I mean? They probably do, man. Now, that song was with David, right? Now, David was the greatest warrior in Israel. One of them. Yeah. Now, now even he said he didn't trust in his, his uh, sword. Well, he trusted in Moabat. He trusted in Yahweh what Yahweh shot. That was his greatest sword right there. Exactly. That was his greatest weapon. That's what made David the, the warrior he was. He said, the Lord teaches my hands how to war. When you please the when you please the Lord the way David did, man, his enemy, man, you couldn't, David was so thorough with it through the spirit. You didn't see, David was not, he, where did David come from? He came from watching sheep, man. He came from a lonely upbringing to, to being a warrior that he was. And, and there's times that he, he used his, his mind the most, man. That spirit is what makes you a warrior for this thing, man. That's why we're coming out here now and showing the spiritual side and Lord willing to make